Hello everybody, my name is Lachara, and this is Craftopia. Another episode of my Let's Play series. Let's uh, pick up some, get some iron ingots. We got some silver ingots. Do we want to make some steel? How much? Ooh, I have a lot of iron right now, so let's make... Oh, let's make five more steel. Just to keep the furnaces working. Oh, what else could we do here? I might as well make some copper too while we're at it. Eh, we, not that we had much, 15... But it's something. So in the last episode, we uh, did some more fishing. We built this power generator. We did make some batteries. So basically, you catch animals in like the monster prisms, I think they're called. They're essentially pokeballs. <laughs> so you catch the monsters, put them in there. So we're going to do some more of that. We're going to make some more batteries. But the big focus today, we're going to get... Let's pick up the steel. We're going to get... Um, we're going to get one of these. We're going to get a livestock farm on the go. We need some milk for that. So we need milk to get milk, essentially. That's going to be one focus. We might also get some more um, farming plots on the go. We have a wheat farm back at our old original island, but I want to grow some other crops because we have a ton of different seeds. Like we have bean seeds, potato seeds, wild seed of snow mint, red herb seeds, uh, Seed patty, which is rice, pepper seeds, corn seeds, and we got poop because, you know, I'm assuming you use the poop to make fertilizer. So that's why it's in with the seeds. <laughs> All right. So we're looking for cows right now. I know there's cows around or you know what? You know where I know there's definitely cows back on our original island. So let's go there and kill a cow or two or three or all of them. Maybe we'll catch some while we're here. We'll see. And if we get that done, maybe we'll do some other things like I'd like to, I'd love to get the um, automated. Oh, what's the word I'm looking for? The automated miners. I'd like to get some of them put down would be nice as well. All right. So I believe there are cows right over here. Over here. They're there. All right. So we need three milk to make the animal thing. So hoping we get some milk from this cow. We did. We got one milk. All right, so let's kill one more cow, and then maybe we'll get a get the animal monster prisms. What are they called? I don't want to keep calling them. Yeah, monster prisms. I don't want to call them pokeballs. So can we catch this cow? They're only level like four. So can we catch it without doing damage to it? Well, you know what would help if I didn't miss. So can we pick it up? Yes. All right. Oh, it's too energetic, so we got to damage it first, but I'm scared I'm just going to one-shot it, right? All right, well, let's see here. Let's get the old sword out again. All right, so where's the level four? All right, so that wasn't a one-shot. <laughs> okay, there we go. I was going to say we missed twice. All right, so we got a cow. Oh, so let's pick up our... I don't know how I missed from that close. Like, that was point-blank range, and I still managed to miss. All right, so let's, uh, oh, let's, let's grab red herbs while I'm here. Cause that's something I don't have a whole lot of. All right, Ken, what about a level one cow? Still too energetic. All right, so you got to damage them. I'm scared, like, like a level one cow. I'm scared I'm just going to one-shot it, though, right? No, I guess not. All right, so you're going to run. We'll wait for you to stop running. See if we catch you. No. Try again. Does that burn through a prism? It must. All right, so we got a couple of cows. All right, so let's head back. We got some cows. We got some milk. So let's head back to where we were. And I, I should be doing these things in the top right corner of the missions as well. So maybe we'll craft some bread. Actually, is this wheat ready to go? While we're here, we might as well grab it, right? Oh, we got some meat cooked up as well. I need to put uh, make a cooking area on my uh, on my new island. I don't even have that stuff over there. I just have it here. So that's something I got to change. I gotta gotta fix that problem. All right. While we're here, do we have any buckets? I think I still have buckets. I might as well might as well get uh, get these watered again. Can we get all four at once again? 
was stand right about here. That was the wrong button. <laughs> or no, I still have the, yeah, I still have the non, still have the empty buckets equipped. There we go. That's weird. I can't wait to have sprinklers because this kind of sucks. Oh, I missed. Kind of. But I had I had three of these, so that was the right amount anyway. There we go. All right. So this will grow while we're back on our other island. And while we're here, uh, grab some more stuff out of these chests. We're slowly trying to move everything out of these chests into, uh, into the new chests. We must be full. Yeah, we are. All right. So let's head back. Do a little inventory. Make the, uh, I don't know what it's called. The animal pasture thing. That's, that's, that's the technical name for it. Animal pasture thing, for sure. Definitely the technical name. All right, so. This is for stuff that, like, is a drop, essentially. Which is most of this stuff. So we'll put all that away. It's starting to get full, though. Crystal, that's not a drop. Ice is not a drop. Basically, anything that drops from an animal goes in this chest. And this is for, like, ores and stuff, so... Put that in crystal. Might as well put gold. I can't make gold bars yet, right? There's no point in holding on to those at the moment. Alright, inventory's looking good. So we should be able to make a... Livestock farm. That is what they're called. All right, so where do we want to put this? I'm assuming it needs to be on grass. Probably close to where we are. Maybe we can just put it here. Yeah, okay. So we got a livestock farm. Oh, it looks like a toaster. <laughs> All right, so where are, we got some cows. So do we, okay, okay, so it's making milk. It'll make 10 milk, and then what? Then what happens? I'm assuming the cow dies. All right, this is kind of disturbing, if I'm being honest. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm comfortable with this, but I guess I have to be. All right, so there's some milk. So we can make another one. We can get some sheep on the go. Uh, but right now, well, let's grab this copper. Uh, we muzzle, muzzle make the copper. We have copper ore. It's not going to do us a whole lot of good. But what I want right now is the uh, the automatic miner thing. Where is that at? Excavator. I know how to make batteries, but how do I make bioethanol? By mouse over this, does it tell me? No. Let me know in the comments if anybody's played this. Where do I get bioethanol? I'm, I'm genu genuinely curious. Alright, but what I need right now as well is I need something. I need to make some more batteries. So let's, uh, let's get another sheep here. Maybe get one of these ones out from under here. Um, oh, so you can, I can just punch them. To get them low. I don't even need my sword. Oh, it's low enough. Hit it with the prism. Hope we catch it. We do not. Hit it with another prism. Got that one. Okay. Captured sheep. Level 8. I don't know if the, if the level matters necessarily. Uh, equip our sheep. Put it in there. Alright. So that'll make some batteries until it dies. Actually... I'm willing to bet that the level, the higher the level, the more batteries it can make before it, it dies or, or whatever happens. But, I mean, that's me guessing. I don't know. So, we got all this on the go. Let's, let's get some cooking stuff here. That's what we said we were going to do. We were going to get cooking stuff here. So, campfire, cooking pot, large pot which needs two cooking pots. You can cook anything. So I'm assuming if you have the large pot, you don't need a cooking pot. Now we need two cooking pots to make the large pot, but I don't need to have both out. I'm assuming. I'm hoping. 
campfire. Well, we'll see. We'll see what the the, uh, the large pot offers here for for material for recipes. All right, so that takes away some of my steel and gets steel is precious because it's five iron to make one steel, and that's that's a lot, right? And I need to eat. Actually, I'm getting a little hungry. So eat some of those. Eat some of those. Eat one of those. Back to a hundred. All right, let's place. Oh my God, this is huge. I mean, I know it said it was huge, but I wasn't expecting it to be this huge. Holy crap on a cracker. Um, <laughs> let's put that away for now. <laughs> uh, do I have any? I have wall. I don't have any. I need horizontal walls, aka floors. <laughs> So let's make some let's make some horizontal walls here. There's ten. I mean I'm gonna need somewhere to put this giant pot, right? <laughs> That's insane how big that is. And another ten. Alright, so let's equip those. Well let me keep building out. Gonna aim just the right place. But we will put our giant, and I mean giant, pot out here. I'm gonna have to make a couple ramps though, too, up and down to this, I think. Because, yeah, I don't like jumping. Jumping's for suckers. I don't like how this one is oriented differently. This one, you're being, you're being a problem child, pick you up. Uh, well, let me pick it up. There we go. And this is what I'm talking about. Need a ramp here. So we do diagonal walls. There we go. That functions as a ramp, essentially. Put one here as well. Perfect. All right, so our cow has passed on. But we got some milk. We got some animal flesh. So we have another cow. So let's put this one in the farm. Okay. Now let's switch back to the horizontal wall and see if we can get this oriented the right way. There we go. All right. Now we can put the, this. I, I mean, I know it says it's a large pot, but I wasn't expecting it to be this large. Right. All right. Any dish will be. Any dish process with the pot will be placed in an open slot. Cooking will not begin if there are no open slots. Oh, so I need to know. I need to know the recipes. For this. I don't know any recipes. Didn't the other one have recipes? Or am I imagining things? Oh, our sheep died. One battery. No, four batteries. Okay, I was going to say. One battery. That's for suckers. That's not what I meant to do. <laughs> Did not mean to pick that up. I meant to use it. I'm going to go back to the other island. I'm going to check the pot because I'm pretty sure it had... I could have swore it had recipes. Like, uh, Maybe not. Maybe I'm thinking of something else. One way to find out, though. I want to check. I want to know curiosity right i know it killed the cat but i'm no cat plus we can harvest some wheat while we're here right getting two birds stoned at once and all that um pretty sure i have this sword equipped don't i no i guess i did not oh you special move <laughs> special jumpy move to see i wish i gotta find some flat rampers. i hate the fact that i need to jump over this little lip like that's I don't know, that just bugs me. Alright, I got a lot of wheat there now. But while I'm here, I might as well plant again, right? Pretty much any time I come here, I'm going to plant some wheat. So we need at least two buckets of water. At minimum. Probably do three just in case I miss. No, you know what? I'm confident in my ability to get all four of these at once. Right here. Nope, I am not confident. Oh, well, four is enough. 
And I'm, am I stuck there? No, we're good. All right, cooking pot. Yeah, it's got a bunch of recipes. Yeah, well, maybe I was I missing something? You know what? I'm taking this with me. <laughs> was I missing a UI element on the big pot? Like, surely they don't expect you to remember all those recipes and what they what their ingredients are, do they? I mean, maybe they do. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, what do I know? I know I'm not full health, so I'm going to heal. I know that. No, no, I don't. Hmm. I don't think I'm missing a UI element. All right, well, we can just put the little pot right next to it, I guess. Right? And then we can use that as a recipe guide, more or less. I don't know. That's weird, though. All right. So, <laughs> now that we have that, what do we need to advance? We need 10 fillets of fish, and we need 30 conveyor belts. All right. Well, let's let's do the fillets of fish first. So we need... There's a, there's a station for that, for filleting fish. Right here, the fillet machine. So, we need a bone. We have bones. Uh, which chest was it? This one? Look at that. One bone right there. Alright, so fillet machine. Let's go. Take that. Where do we want to put this at now? Okay, well this is nice and small. It's not like ridiculously comically huge. I can put this right here, I guess. All right, so uh, what chest did I put the fish in? <laughs> Not that one. There it is. All right, so basically I'm going to take anything that doesn't have a, uh, a prefix other than raw. So we'll take those, take those, take that, and that, um, that one. Do these both have prefixes? Yes. All right, and we're going to fillet all that stuff. Because we needed 10, right? How fast does this work? Yeah, relatively fast, I guess. All right, so conveyor belts. Was it 30, I think, conveyor belts I needed? So that just needs iron. Oh, well, that's easy. Especially since you make 10 at a time. Oh, that's <laughs> way easier than I thought it was going to be. For some reason, I thought that was going to be difficult. All right, so there's, yeah, there's four fillets. Okay, I might need to go fishing again, though, but that's fine. We can go fishing. Oh, hey, my I can almost fish right out of my base. <laughs> almost. Let's just hit this one. I don't think I hit this fishing spot yet, but I'm assuming it's going to be same as the one over there. Now, the river does give different fish than the ocean, but this is still the river. So I'm expecting similar. And we'll jump down and grab it after. Grab them. Yeah, it'd be a lot cooler if just... Oh, I missed that one. If they actually came to you. Oh, I fell in. <laughs> like, fishing on the bank kind of sucks. We got a, a raw, half-dead <laughs> fish there. That's exactly what you want, is half-dead fish. Well, I guess you want them to be fully dead. <laughs> but you know what I mean. Once you catch it, you want it to be fully dead, but you want it to be fully alive. Free catch. Right? All right, look at this being run right under our base. Perfect. We got the ramps up if we want to go up. If not, we can go under. All right, how much milk did we get out of this cow? Not enough. We got some. We've got enough milk that I could make another one of those things now. But isn't there like a, a breeding one? I don't want to have to catch animals constantly. I think this is just too far away. I have to go over here. Which is fine. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not a huge fan. Oh, oh, I didn't think I was close enough. <laughs> Apparently I was. I got a blue quality fish there. Which is cool. Although I don't want to, I don't want to fillet a blue quality, right? I want to hold on to those. All right. We got a blue quality. What, what was it? What's the blue quality? Oh, I don't have a space. 
All right, well, what can I get rid of here? Surely I can put something in the old picture book. All right, is there foods? What's what? I think I only have one of these on me, I think. So that's gone. So we have room for you now? We still don't have room for you? Nope, got it. A raw fresh paraba. I cannot say that that type of fish is familiar with me. To me. Like I usually I usually I recognize the type of fish from either, you know, Stardew Valley or Animal Crossing or whatever other games, but I do not recognize either of those. Or I do not recognize that one, I should say. Well, this sheep just wants to be put in the thing. Alright, so yeah, we'll just do one at a time here. Gonna be a little slow. How many do I have? I think I have six already. Right, fillets? Let's check here. I need ten. Where are the fillets? Where are my... Oh, right here. Yeah, no, I have... I was right. I have seven. So that's eight. And nine. And then we'll do ten. And we'll grab our conveyors. And we should be able to unlock the next uh, level of tech. I believe. Well, salmon. Alright, and then we will store the rest of the fish. Yeah, I kind of wish I had like an alley in the middle. That market needs to move, I think is the big thing. I need to move the market. Um, oh, I have 12 fillets. I must have got more than one at the time. Oh, I guess I, I got 15 milk. I got quite a bit of milk. Can't really complain. All right. And grab the conveyors. And let's see if that will allow us to unlock the next era of technology. It will. We are in the Renaissance. We can make helicopters, guns, automatic assembly machines. Bunch of stuff related to logistics, including an auto cooker, gold tools, gold weapons, automatic furnace. Wow. Yeah, this is um there's a lot of things here. <laughs> Some new armor as well. Alright, anyway, let's progress the age. Ooh, that used 20 steel though. That's a lot. I mean, think about it, that's a hundred iron. Just gone, just like that. All right, so let's go back and do some of these missions we have here on the top right. Craft bread at the cooking pot. Bread. We need wheat flour. Let's make a whole bunch of wheat flour. There we go. We will come back for that later. All right. Craft rotating saws. What do those need? Battery oh, and bioethanol. Hmm. All right, I need to figure out where to get bioethanol. Is there anything here that would like that would extract bioethanol? You can refine your weapons with refining stones to increase their attack. This refinery can handle up to low grade refining stones. That's an expensive thing though. Uh, maybe the potion brewing stand? Maybe we should make that uh, red herbs. I have red herbs somewhere, I think. She would probably be here, right? All kinds of red herbs. So let's make this potion stand. Nutrition supplement bucket. The supplement dramatically stimulates growth and pour it onto tree ceilings. Okay. Let's see if bioethanol is made at the potion stand. Actually, yes, and we're moving this market. It's too close. I want space here. There. Put it there. And then we will put the potion stand right there. I do not see bioethanol. No, I do not. All right. Um, What if... 
Can you go back into old ages that you already have? No. Alright, well, let's just make sure, like, we don't already have bioethanol. <laughs> we got artificial monoliths. Oh, they're work in progress. They're not part of the game yet. Basic organic material clay. No. No, I do not see bioethanol there. Let's see. Assembly machine, furnace. Like, I just... I don't think any of these would make bioethanol. I'll check the cooking pot after this. It may be there. Aging facilities? Oh, here it is. You can create bioethanol with it too, it says. The two makes me think there's... That's not the only place to do bioethanol. All right, where was it? Aging facility. All right. Now the key is what, <laughs> what do we need to make bioethanol? That's, that's going to be the trick, right? How it's, everything else is relatively small. And then that, <laughs> I'm still laughing at how big that pot is. Okay. Oh, it's wheat flour. Let me guess. I can make it at the cooking pot, can I? Probably. I need a lot of wheat in this game. No, I don't see it here, actually. Wheat flour is, like, extremely important. Alright, so let's make one bread. To satisfy the quest. Alright, so we got some mission categories we can claim. Hey, consumable, consumable inventory up. I'll take that. Oh, what is this? Main mission. Oh, coming soon. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so we got some bread. But I'm not blind, right? I don't see bioethanol here anywhere. No, I don't see it. There's a lot of things here, though. That, like, like grapes, honey... Now, ice I do have. I can do ice. But, like, why would you... Why would you make this? Reduces your attack by 50. I guess if you were doing a magic build, maybe? Or is the, maybe the heat resistance is that valuable? I don't know. That seems bad to me. <laughs> Ooh, maximum stamina up is nice. No, right, anyway... These things aren't what we're focused on right now. Bioethanol is. So I need to go grab some more wheat. I think I need to make... I need to grow some wheat here. I'm, I'm sick of running back and forth to get more wheat. It's not working long term. But it is what it is, I guess. For now. Equip my sword. Oh, I should probably make new tools too. Oh, and I forgot. Last time I was here, I don't think I, uh, I don't think I, I, I should always, anytime I'm here on this island, I should load up my inventory to, to slowly clear out these chests, right? Okay, that one's empty. This one is not empty. Oh, got some poop. Oh, this one. Oh, a whole bunch of wheat. That's good. Oh, Bunch of valuable stuff in there. All right. Well, you know what? I'm going to go back. I'm going to do some inventory management. Going to make some more uh, wheat flour, and then we'll have a we'll have a bunch of wheat flour ready to go for next time. We can make some bioethanol. We can put it, make some more bread, some other things, and uh, yeah. Once we have bioethanol, that opens up a whole bunch of other things. We can finally get the automated crafting stuff on the go. I know I'm looking forward to it. I hope you are too, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Twitter. Join my Discord. Consider supporting me on Patreon. I would greatly appreciate it. Links in the description down below to all that. Most importantly, be good to each other. Have a great day. And I'll see you in the next one.